Hello again, everybody. Welcome to the another edition of Let's Draw Cartoons with Rick. Today, we're going to draw a basketball player dunking a basketball. So let's grab our pencils and start drawing. So, like we always do, we tend to draw eyes first. So let's draw two circles and then two little dots. And then let's give, give him a nose. And then we're going to round off the top of his head. And let's draw his ear, which is another half circle with a little line on it. And then let's draw the bottom of his face. And then his other ear. And let's give him a big smile. He's really happy he's dunking. And then we'll draw his hairline. This is just a line that goes all the way around. And let's fill up this hairline with dark hair. So we'll get our black pens and fill that in really good. There we go. Now we'll just draw his neck. And then we're going to draw his collar of a shirt or jersey. And then the two lines that come down. And then let's draw his arm straight up two straight lines together and then we'll draw his thumb that curls around and then we'll draw his forefinger that's there and we'll just do the edges of a couple of more fingers and he'll be holding this basketball so let's make a circle comes all the way around and basketballs have these interesting lines they have lines that curve like this so two curved that way from each other so it looks like a baseball and then there's a line down the center it's like an equator on the earth and then another line that comes down that way so next we're going to draw the basket so let's draw a long oval and then we'll outline this oval right about here and then let's make the basket shape, which is kind of two concave lines. And at the bottom, we'll make like a ziggy zaggy line. <clears throat> now the pattern of the basket netting is like a diamond. So let's draw a bunch of diamonds next to each other. And then you see in the spaces that they alternate and it starts to show the netting pattern. So we stack them up inside the spaces and it doesn't have to be like a perfect diamond just as long as it shows the suggestion of a diamond and then at the top we'll just make these these and there's the basket now on the basket back board there's a square where the nets attached and then we'll draw a couple of straight lines and then do the backboard make that go across just like that let's go back to the player and let's draw his other arm straight out and then we're going to draw his fingers one two three four and then we'll make his thumb go down so he's like he's pushing away anybody that's coming near him then let's draw the bottom of his jersey which is a curved line and then we'll draw his basketball shorts. So a line down and then over and then up and down and then around and come up. And those are his shorts. And we're going to make him like he's flying through the air. So let's bend his legs. Let's draw two lines that come in and then another line that comes up and connects. And let's draw his sock. And then we'll do his sneaker comes around like that and we'll draw the bottom part of his sneaker like the sole and then a couple of lines for his laces on the sneaker and then maybe a couple of custom lines on the side and let's do the other leg we're gonna make this one come up down and back and we're not gonna really see the whole sneaker so we're just gonna do like the edge of the sneaker down here and the laces and a sock and let's give him a number let's go 31 let's do that that's a good number it's like backwards on lucky number 13 and you can add a couple of details on his jersey some stripes and maybe the pole for the basket 
and maybe some action lines like he's coming up in the air just like that and there you have it we just drew a basketball player slam dunking a basketball so make sure you check your emails for the next edition of Let's Draw with Rick, or you can check the archives on the site and take any lesson that you like and draw as many as you want. So next time, we'll see you on Let's Draw Cartoons with Rick. Bye.